Hey everybody Hi. and welcome to Shoppers Spotlight. I am Maria and this is my host, co-host, Sarah. Yay! Um, so who are we interviewing today? Um, I don't know. I thought you knew. Ah, uh, shoot. Um, actually, let's interview you. <gasps> Yay! Yay! I thought I... you'd never ask. <laughs> um, so as you guys know, we've been having a lot of fun. We have. Uh, interviewing, so being fun. in our PJs in Christmas gear, um, seeing the amazing vendors that we have. And so um, we're just really two moms who wanted to help with the PJ market and let people, you know, get out there due to COVID and stuff. There's like vendor events not quite um, open to the public and stuff. And so as you can see, um, we're hiding behind the couch, having a great time, and this uh, pterodactyl is going to leave in just a second, and then we're going to get into our interview. So, um, that's just how we roll. Yeah. You just, mom you just go with it. Mom life. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, Sarah is with Epicure. Yes. And, um, I actually feel like when we're interviewing each other, it's like I could almost do yours and you could almost do mine. That's so true. <laughs> um, I love Epicure and um, clearly her kids love Discovery Toys. Yes. So um, okay. it's Thank really you. fun to be like, yeah, interviewing you. So could you show us, actually, could you tell us first a little bit about Epicure and then we'll go into your favorite product okay. or so. Yeah, that okay. would be great. Yeah. All right, let's see. First of all, I have to say, I'm a little bit biased, but I think Epicure is like the best one of the week because <laughs> just one simple thing. It's food! Yeah. Everybody loves to eat! We're not supposed to really do this right before supper. Like, I'm starving. Why are we oh. talking about food? Ah, oh, dear. <laughs> well, you're pregnant. You're always hungry. So True. whenever we talk about food, it's always a good time. Epicure is always a party mm. on a plate because we, I just love to eat. So, Epicure is a 100% Canadian company yeah, yeah. that is women owned and led. And we have an amazing array of spice blends, dip mixes, um, fast and easy dinner solutions. And no, no, fast, easy, and delicious. Delicious and healthy dinner mm -hmm. solutions <laughs> um, that will get your food on the table in 20 minutes or less. And we also have a uh, wonderful array of silicone cookware to help you get the job done fast. Yes. Um, all of our products are completely gluten-free, egg-free, nut-free, but they are super packed with labor. Yes, they we are. We have very high quality, very high standards. We are GMO-free, we're like uh, organic, and very low sodium and low sugar. We have no fillers, we have no like nasty chemicals. We have a list that has, it's called our never ever list, that has hundreds of ingredients that you will never find in any of our products. Yes. And so because we don't have fillers, because we don't have all those yucky bits in there, what you get is like pure unadulterated flavor from everything that we have. And it's you true. will just get punched in the face with flavor and you'll go, what? I can't believe I made this, it's delicious. Exactly, That's. A, I was thinking of my husband's commercial that he did for you, I can't remember. Yes. Was it the Thai, the Thai stir fry, I think is what it's called? Yeah, he was like, starting to tell me at supper he's like I take a bite and it's sweet and now it's sour and now it's and I'm like pause we gotta we gotta make a video for Sarah yeah. and so yeah he was like he's like you literally take a bite and every bite you like taste a little something else he was like I was his favorite wifey ever I mean I'm his only wifey but you know that day I was like yeah the best wife Epicure. award winner goes mm -hmm. to Maria he really does only have one I'm not sure why I said that <laughs> baby brain um <laughs> but yeah so epicure is awesome do you have one product or two that are your fave fave favorites first of all i do so first of all i have to say i'm like santa's elf because i'm bringing you all of the stock and stuffers mm -hmm. oh. because our products are actually really relatively small and can fit really well in stockings small but last a long time yeah they do That's they do because they're jars of spices so yeah and you don't have to use like 500 like you don't have to use it all it's literally natural yummy so my number one most favorite product that I tell everyone, if you only buy one thing from Epicure ever, just to try something, it's gotta be this. This is our herb and garlic oh, dip I don't even mix. have this one. What? I never tried this. Girl, you know 
what she's getting in her stocking this year. This is a dip mix, but I don't actually use it for dip. I put it anywhere that calls for garlic. It's got a mixture of herbs and garlic, but I won't tell you which herbs because it's great. But it's so good. And anytime that something calls for garlic, you put this instead. And it is going to up your game of your dish amazing. Nice. It's good in like pasta. I put it on pizza. You can put it into uh, eggs. You can put it on rub it in oil and then just dump this all over your meat and rub it in and bake it and it's like roast it. It's good to go. Nice. Um, I, yeah, I put it in rice. Um, I put this stuff on everything. It's like my most favorite. But one really nice thing about all of our jars is that the recipes are right mm -hmm. on the side. That's of, so helpful. Right on the side. So it'll actually tell you all different ways that you can use it. Yes. And it actually gives you a couple of recipes on the side. I know, on this little bottle, how do they do that? That's so how helpful. easy our stuff is. And like none of our products, like any of our dip mixes or any of the other food things that you buy, have any like weird or unusual ingredients in it. You'll always know what right. it is. So after that, I'm going to talk about our meal solutions because mm -hmm. this is the solution to your what am I going to eat for dinner at 5 o'clock. This is it. This is well, one of them. We have so many. Yeah. These are called our meal solutions. They feed a family of four and can be made in 20 minutes or less in just one pot on the stove, one pan in the oven, or one dish in your microwave and it cooks up super fast. The so recipe yummy. is right mm. on the back. You never need more than five fresh ingredients that are regular everyday things. And it tells you right on the back what to mm -hmm. do with it and it also tells you what um, substitutions you can make so that they That's are right, vegan and vegetarian exactly. friendly. Yeah. And we have so many. This one is my personal favorite, sweet garlic chicken. It's a sheet pan dinner and it's so good and it's you literally dump everything on your sheet pan and it's done in like not even 20 minutes. I think it's 17 awesome. minutes in the oven. My favorite is pad thai, oh, yeah. butter chicken, oh, yeah. the Thai stir fry, pretty much anything. But those are the three that I can think of fast. Really, really good. And the ooey gooey one. What's it called? So. Yeah, that Which one. Which is like oh, a man. thick, warm Adding it to sauce. pasta and to spice up things. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, so My good. My other favorite, so because our jars are so small, even our packets, they can fit in your stockings. And so in my stocking, because I'm Santa's elf today, I've got our extraordinary trio, which has been around since pretty much since Epicure started for like oh, over 20 years. Yeah. And so this is three different that you can buy hey. together as a set. And they're extraordinary because you can use them in everything. They're like my top selling product. Everybody loves them. It's lemon dilly, three yes. onion, and CCB, which stands for uh, cheese, chives, and bacon. And, but it's not real bacon, it's made of pinto beans, so it's safe for like vegan vegetarian. Um, the three onion, three tablespoons of this equals one full onion. So you can put it into any oh, dish that, that calls That's for cool. onion. You don't have to chop up an onion and cry and be like, right. oh, my eyes hurt. And so you can use these just about on everything and combined together, they're like a super force. They create the extraordinary cheese <laughs> dip, which you make up hot in your microwave or your oven. And it is the thing that will have all your guests asking you for the recipe because Nice. It's so good. We uh, we use see the CCB in like our potatoes. I don't make oh, yeah. potatoes without it anymore. Uh, adding it to my potato salad. Oh, so. Pick mm, it up mm, a notch. Mm. Add the herb and garlic. Yeah, I don't have those yet. Yeah, see? Your potatoes. So. Epic. So, uh, like I said, last year I don't know if you guys remember, but we had the Epicure Meals Epic. Epic. Yeah. I'm just going to touch on we have a full range of silicone cookware. Yes. And my top two sellers, and my top two, because they're my top two favorites, so they're my top two sellers. Of right, of course. Um, is the multi-purpose steamer, which if you saw my video this week, I've told you it's called multi-purpose. It's a real workhorse. It does everything. It goes in your oven. It goes in your microwave. It goes in your fridge, in your freezer, and you can throw it in your dishwasher to clean it up. Mm -hmm. um, you can bake in it. You can roast in it. You can pop it in your microwave and make just about anything in it. And if you were to host a cooking class with me or talk with me, I could tell you all the ways to use it because there's like 101 Corn on the cob, ways. rice, on chicken, cob, rice. asparagus, burgers, bacon. Those are bacon. the things I can yep. think of that I've on used. The it. tray mm -hmm. and rice. 
and actually this week in my um, VIP group, I'm going to be showing everybody how to make bracelets. I'm so sorry, but I hear the fart gun behind us. I know. It's so <laughs> if you hear farts, it's just the fart gun. No big deal. And uh, my other favorite is this right here. These are our muffin makers. They're designed to fit in your microwave. You can make muffins or cupcakes in just three minutes. Wow. And that is with one of our mixes, which are all gluten-free, or just with your own regular mix for cupcakes or muffins. Yep. You pop it, put them in here, put it in your microwave, three minutes, they come out perfectly fresh and delicious. Or you can put them on a sheet tray because they're wobbly, um, side by side, and bake them in the oven as you would with regular yeah. muffin tins. That's what I did with the pumpkin spice. Delicious. Yes. Little pumpkin. Oh. Mm. And we have a bunch of mixes that make muffins and loaves and things that you can do in here. And another thing that I love about these, which is my hack that I tell yes, everyone about. Yes, I love this hack too. Is that each one of these wells holds exactly a quarter of a cup. So if you have leftover sauces pumpkin. or like pumpkin puree or tomato sauce mm -hmm. or whatever, you can plop them in here, pop this in your freezer, pull them out and these just pop it out It works, like this. I have some. And you put them into mm -hmm. a freezer bag and then you know that you have exactly as much as you need. They're all quarter of a cup yep. portions. So and you don't waste it or put it in. You it. know when you like saran wrap the can, put it in thinking you're like gonna use it and then you're like, hey, this green stuff that's supposed to be orange. Yes. yes. So exactly, that's awesome. So that's just a little bit about Epicure. It's like I could talk about it all day. I have so mm -hmm. I'm probably good too. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for the shower. Um, it is definitely like, like I was a little skeptical. Right when I came to your when I came to your first party, I was like, spices cool, you know what is it? It's not gonna be like so amazing, but I was like, it was not at all like that. I was eating the food, watching her cook it, and I'm like, okay, I who's busy, who has no time, and is not the best cook, like I could do this, and I've upped my game, and it's amazing, and. And we made that night a full fajita dinner to mm. feed a family of four. Chicken fajitas with fresh vegetables. We made fresh guac, fresh salsa, mm -hmm. all in 20 minutes. And we took it home. My husband had to warm it up a little, and he was like, this is real good. So, 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 so good. You can do it. Yes, you can. It has given me the confidence, and yeah, I love it. Epic here is awesome. So, I'm glad I got to interview you. Yeah. Um, okay, just wait one minute. We're just finishing up. <laughs> Mom, Mom life. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So I have a question for you. Christmas questions coming up. Yeah, it's not eggnog because I know you love eggnog like me. You got, you got it. Um, but uh, if we went to the mall and you could choose any actor to be the mall Santa and have a little chat, who would you choose? <laughs> Ladies, oh my gosh, this is a hard one because there's some like really interesting people that I'd want to talk to. <laughs> um, let's just say that if my husband wasn't there, maybe even if he was, <laughs> I would probably go and chat with, um, I would say like Jason Momoa or it would be uh, Justin Baldoni. Or, oh, I don't even um, know who that is. I don't, know. I don't think so. I probably know, but not the name. Um, well, he played Raphael in Jane the Virgin, mm. the TV show. All my Jane the Virgin fans Sorry, are folks. No. Um, um, but they'll know, so that's all yeah. that matters. <laughs> or, or actually, like, I actually really would hope it would be like Jerry Seinfeld or maybe <laughs> yeah. like Gabriel Iglesias because they're like my two favorite stand up comedians and I'd love there to you go. And just pick their brains a bit about because I like to be I think I'm pretty funny and I like to like <laughs> ask them for some good stories and tips yeah that's awesome yeah. Uh, I'm gonna ask one more okay sure. just because I know like we're talking about food and baking and stuff mm -hmm. um what is your best Christmas treat to like make or eat <gasps> oh I'm oh, I'm a cookie person I do lots of cookies huh? at Christmas um Oh, but I guess my one most favorite is probably gingerbread cookies or shortbread cookies. Those are the two that have to be in my Christmas. Um, nice. <laughs> have to be in my uh, Christmas um, plates, definitely. Um, shortbread. But if you come into my my group on Facebook, Sarah's. Oh, hi. 
Sarah's Spice Kitchen on Facebook. I have recipes in there. Awesome. Well, I guess we are done our shopper spotlight for today. Things are getting um, a little rowdy here. On and the farm. so um, I just wanted to, yeah, say thank you so much, Sarah. What we, about their uh, question? Oh, the question. Okay. Um, <laughs> this is a tricky one. This, this interview is going really this long. This is today. a tricky if, one. If anybody's still watching now that we're at the end. The question is the, um, <clears throat> the CCB. Oh, yeah. What does it stand for? Nope. Nope. That's easy. Maybe. It, uh, it, what does it stand for? <laughs> no, what, what, say it, what is it actually called? It stands for cheese, chives, and bacon. Yes. What is actually in it? Some of those things are wrong. There's one thing that's oh, not actually thing. in yeah, here. Because it's vegetarian friendly. Exactly. So, what is, so what is the item that's really not here, but it says it's here? Yeah. That's kind of tricky, but you'll get it. Mm hmm. All right. See you guys later. Bye. Have a good one. Bye. Bye.